friends. Welcome to my RV kitchen. Like I'm physically in my RV and in the kitchen. So today we're doing a quick video on recipe inspiration and I wanted to share five books that I've used or will use in our recipes to come. So first, this book came out at the beginning of the month and it's called The Lazy Genius Kitchen by Kendra Adachi. So interesting story. This book was supposed to come out in March of 2022. There was a shipping container accident and her books were at the bottom of the ocean. So they got pushed back to May. But basically this book is not necessarily teaching you recipes, but it's teaching you how to make the best use of your kitchen. From space to choosing your utensils, your tools, even what she calls the liquid index, which is basically how do you use liquid in cooking? What's the difference between a saute, a braise, a stew, a soup, all the things. If you've not read her book, The Lazy Genius Way, I suggest reading that one first and then The Lazy Genius Kitchen. My OG girl, Rachel Ray, um, one of my favorite 30 minute meals. She now has, or well, it's been out for a while, her looking cook book, and it gives you beautiful step-by-step -step color pictures. And one of the things you can do with these cookbooks is look and see what you would like to cook and then think of ways that you can freeze it, make it into smaller portions, or have the flavors and make it something a little different. Now, one of my favorite cooking blogs that I followed way, way back, and I've lost the dust jacket, um, is The Pioneer Woman, and this is her first cookbook. I use it all the time, like it folds. The poor spine is broken right at meatloaf. But she again also does look and cook as well. Um, it also opens to the cinnamon roll recipe, which if you enjoy baking, may not necessarily be lazy RV cooking friendly, but it's pretty tasty. Um, one of the best cookbooks, I think, for RVers is Trisha Leach's book, Small Space, Big Taste. She's a full-time RVer. Um, they do their channel, um, Keep Your Daydream. And all of these recipes and tools are designed for your small space in your RV. So she makes recipes that would be easy to do in your little RV kitchen. And last but certainly not least, I don't know if there's a house in America or may, uh, maybe in the South that doesn't have this cookbook. My mom's got a copy. I think this is my second copy, but it is Better Homes and Gardens new cookbook. Like, I don't think these recipes have changed that much. But what I like about this cookbook is that it's a classic. It's got lots of categories. It's got gorgeous, this is also well loved, um, tabs for different categories, meats and stews and fish and poultry, all the things. So this book, you can look through it, pick your inspiration and start cooking some lazy RV meals. So let us know in the comments what cookbooks you like to use as inspiration. Hit that follow button, subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell. It's a bell. And get our alerts for our videos. Thank you for coming to our Lazy RV Kitchen.